Smackdown Live. Sweet. And let's hurry up. I feel pretty sleepy. <laughs> I might end up falling asleep in this. Um, Superman sets off and he wants to talk about Roman Reigns, what Roman did to Tens. They show the footage and then pretty much he's saying that he's ordering Roman Reigns to come out. He, it's not a request, he's ordering him. Then Roman Reigns comes out. Um, Alright, yeah. let's wrap it up. While he's walking, Elias comes and attacks him from behind. Well, you skipped, no. you, you no, missed skip, it. Skip this, skip this, skip this. Alright, here. Roman's standing in the middle of the ring. He has a mic in his hand. He drops the mic. Shane drops the mic. They're yeah. gonna fight each other. Elias comes and attacks Roman. Yeah. Then comes I Shane. Should. So they both uh, start beating up Roman Reigns. Yeah. So poor Roman, Missy. I know. So, Elias, later on, issues a challenge to Roman Reigns yeah. by singing, saying he's going to face him at Money in the Bank. And Roman wants to break yep, his Yep, and Shane, Shane's like, yeah, that sounds awesome. Then they get in their limo. Yep, and then ends up being the first match of the night, Finn Balancey and Almez. Finn wins. Finn wins. Vega, oh, was at the top of the rope, and she was going to do the move on move. Finn, and Finn dodged, and uh, almost caught her, and... As he put her down, Finn kicks her in the face, and that gives him the um, coup de gras, and then there you go, and pins him, there you go, easy win. Yep, and then end up being uh, Car Shane and Peyton Royce. Yep. Iconic. Oh, iconic. Kari won by giving her the insane elbow. Yeah, she did the insane elbow, top rope. But before the match, of course, stupid the context one is sort of like, really? You get these? Well, before that, we see um, uh, Mandy Rose and Sonya Deville. But yeah, they were backstage yeah. talking, so, like, really? Sonya Deville has that big ass Triple H nose. Yeah, but mm. after uh, the Kari and Peyton Royce match, they came out. Mandy and Sonya came out, and they're like clapping, like, uh, uh. Yeah. yeah. And then Jinder Mahal's coming out. This is match. Magic carpet ride. Yep, and he's going against Chad Gable, but what ends up not being the match? Lars Sullivan attacks Chad again from behind, gets in the ring. Ginger mm -hmm. gets out of the ring, but. Both of his both of his Singh brother guys end up getting um, power slammed and power bombed by Lars. Yeah, and then and then our truth shows up because that last week you guys asked for, well, so our truth won revenge, and he ends up getting both the same treatment as the Singh brothers. Uh huh. Mm -hmm. And then there was this Charlotte and Becky Lynch face to face. Of course. So it's pretty much Charlotte saying that she wants the SmackDown title back. Pretty she much. Deserves, yeah, we she deserves. deserves it. Everybody stands behind her. She should be standing against Becky. But Becky's like saying, "I'm." T but um, Becky's saying, "I'm tired of your bullshit. I want to fight new people. Management won't allow it." And then Becky, sh I mean, um, Bailey shows up, and Bailey's getting tired of listening to Charlotte whine and complain so she ends up challenging her and Charlotte's like you're not worth it and then Bailey just slaps the microphone out of her hand and what ends up being Charlotte versus Bailey yeah she and Charlotte won she gave her the spear and there you go pinned her yeah because she's tired of watching reruns pretty much no Charlotte friggin no I'm talking about Bailey how she was saying about how it was rerun it's supposed to be all new because of the shake up that's not what you said. You said, oh, whatever. Let's just keep going. And then there's nothing to do. Becky. And then Becky says she'll always be Becky too, guys. But here's the thing. She's got, on Money in the Bank. She's putting both her titles on the line. Yep. So she's putting her Raw titles against Lacey Evans. And she's putting her SmackDown title against Charlotte. Yep. So she's going to be fighting two matches. Yep. And she can take them both. Oh, oh my god, they did that Firefly Funhouse again. Yeah, it's still freaking weird. Oh my god. TV's Playhouse with <laughs> Bray Wyatt. Oh man. That shit's not gonna last. But, anyway, let's go to the main event. Kofi Kingston versus Nakamura. Come on. <laughs> Even though Kofi did the come on during the match. Oh yeah. He mocked him. 
Rusev, uh, Rusev came in but and got, got, caused the disqualification. Yeah, yeah, he came in and Woods got rid of Rusev. Then Nakamura got rid of Woods, and then there was a tri um, triple paradise to um, Nakamura. No, who did Chucky do a triple paradise to? I don't know. He gave the trouble in paradise. He tried to give it to Nakamura, but yeah, here's the Nakamura. thing. I called this right before the match even started. I said Kevin Owens is going to end up heel turning, and he did it tonight. He super kicked Kofi Kingston. Yeah. So yeah. so, yeah, see, there's the Kevin Owens we know. That's way better. Porter potty. Better than that. I, I can't see Owens' face, so this is weird. All I see is him as a porter potty. Oh. So you want him in your porter potty. Ew, disgusting. And then... Uh, he belongs with piss hands. That's just pretty much it. it. How did you like this week of SmackDown? Do you like how Claw Woods turned on the New Day? Did you uh, say Xavier he... Woods? It's Kevin Owens. Owens. Oh, I'm sorry. See, we're tired. No. Owens? Are you tired that the o Owens, Big O, whatever his stupid name was, turned on the new day? I'm getting sleepy, seriously. And... It's 11.30. What about with Roman? That, yeah. That, that Are you excited to up. see Elias versus Roman? Let's go, my Roman. I'm excited that Becky's going to get two titles. Mm. Um... Charlotte and what not. Yeah. Let us know. Let us hear. So make sure you like, comment, subscribe. I'll we'll see you next time. Bye. Bye. Hello. Yay. And now we're back with 205 Live. Yeah. And now it starts off right with a match. Chukuchu mm -hmm. Gulak Ugh. versus Humberto Carrillo. Taylor Lautner. Yeah. yeah, yeah. And I would say these two matches that happened tonight were pretty good matches. They were pretty long. So. Yeah, I'm especially telling her, Lothner looker. Yeah. Wow. I like in the beginning, though, that Gulick was trying to uh, order Humberto around. It's like, really? You're going against him. Why are you trying to order him around? Like, but, literally. Yeah, but he put in a lot of effort. His face was turning red because he he was doing pretty good. Tell yeah. Humberto. But Humberto won with a top rope twist press. Um, Which was awesome. After he did a power bomb, mm -hmm. and then he almost tapped when um, Gulak had him in the ankle lock, and then he almost he almost got him because he got out of the ankle lock and he almost got him with a via roll up. So, but he ended up winning with a twist, top rope twist press. So. Yeah, but we all know who wasn't there. The weird looking sock guy. <laughs> Jack Gallagher. Yeah, but where the heck was he? Wouldn't he be like in one of those two corners or he's going to be like the, what, the middle man? Now I'm just like, I'm going to stand in the middle between you two. I can't decide who I want to be with. I have no idea. And then there was um a little backstage thing with um Maria, Mike, and Drake. The sound. And Drake's like, all the time. All the time, it's always, you gotta say something about um, Mike's performances. All the time. And then, they get interrupted uh, with Brian Kendrick, and Brian Kendrick is pretty much saying how Maria tried to put herself in the match, get yeah. distracting Akira, and Maria's like, well, I... Why is Kira just looking in the mirror? Oh, that's right. If he's a f if he's up for it, not afraid. Yeah. And then Mike's like, "Why are you even here?" And Brian's like, "Yeah, uh, but actually, I'm here for a distraction." Yeah. And they're like, "What? What?" And then, and then they, out of the blue, Kira Tawaza. Well, bam! Just started started go wailing on him. Yep, and how to get um, securities. And, Two guys to hold and all of a sudden, Mike uh, can now punches Akira, and Drake's like, "That's no, that's uncalled for. Yeah. No." So there's probably going to be no match with them, obviously against oh, who's those two. Yeah. Because that'll be like the third match, third or fourth match with them, and then. But you know she's going to cheat, like always. Yep. And then main event, Oni Lorcan. God. Versus Arya Divari. Yeah. Okay. Um, 
This was another really, really impressive match. They both, oof, they both, but, oof. Yeah, even though I don't care for neither one, I would say Ard, yeah, he's alright. Yeah. I'm not a fan of both of them, but, oh yeah, it's all over it. He's a better wrestler than, than that weird looking creepy, he kind of looks like Cesaro at first for a little bit there. <laughs> Baldy. But... Ari Devari ends up winning. He uh he won with first he did like a kick when um Oni uh did like a massive clothesline thingy and then he Oni was gonna run towards him in the corner and Aria did a kick and then he ended up doing a frog splash and then he ended up doing the hammer lock for the win. Well, that checker came out in the beginning. Yeah, he came out to watch the match. Yeah. He sat there, sitting there. It's 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 like Champa when he made love to his belt. He had to have it too, you know. Yeah, well, that's all champions. And then um, Tony, after the match, offered his hand to him. To him, and Arya's like, "I want that." Yeah. And then he's like, Tony's like, me. "Try and take it from me," and he's holding it up. Yep. Yeah. So it's gonna end up being uh Tony Nese versus Arya Davari. Now out of that That's gonna be a tough match. It's gonna be tough, but I wanna see Tony Nese win and keep the belt. Yeah, he deserves it. Because I mean even though yeah, I like Tony Nese. <laughs> even though I'm, I like him too, it's just not like a big, big, big fan. He's he's, he's better than Arya Davari's at wrestling. Yeah. He's got a lot of good moves there. I mean, I th I would say, I, I, I said these two matches tonight were really impressive. They were pretty much, they weren't quick. They weren't like one, two, three. No. They were pretty they, much, they were pretty much quick. It was close. Couple, cu couple close, like one, two, threes, and it, it was, it was, it was tough. So, what did you thought of two or five lives? Did you like the matches? Are you excited for Tony Nese and Arya Davari? Who do you want to win out of them? Yeah. Nese or the Arya? I wonder what's going to be shocking events is going to be next week. Yeah, next freaking yeah. Tuesday. What's going to... It's probably going to be something with Akira Tawaza or Brian Kendrick. Or something new might happen. You never know. I mean, anything can happen on 205. You never know. I mean... It would be nice to see Pisshound get shoved into a toilet. Didn't he get that one time? <laughs> Didn't he get that one time with his tie? I think so. With the uh, all sorts of pain. They did, didn't they take his coat, was it? Or his tie? No, he took Bobby Roode's took, took coat him. and <laughs> drove and put it in the toilet. Yeah. That's right. Yeah, that's why he's pissed hound. And not only that, because he pissed himself. <laughs> yeah, he pissed himself because he's eating Big Show. <laughs> yeah, fun. no! No, 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 But, oh, that was crazy. I mean, we'll, we'll find out. Yeah. So, make sure you like. Comment. Subscribe. And we'll see you next time. Bye. Bye.